Yeah, we uh, we went down to the tournament in Evansville. Um, nice long journey again for us, but um, uh, we really we really had a good experience there. The girls um, obviously it's been a while since we went back, and this group of players hadn't been there, so um, so they were soaking everything in. Um, the game Friday night against Evansville uh, was a close game. Uh, we started off uh, conceding a goal very early, which is very unlike us, and uh, obviously wasn't the ideal start to the game, but. Um, I actually thought we played pretty well, um, definitely competed, definitely uh, worked extremely hard and I'm not sure we had any real clear cut chances but um, you know, definitely had some half chances that um, obviously if we'd have scored I think it would, might have been a different game but um, we lost 1-0 and um, Evansville uh, yesterday went on to win in the uh, championship on penalty kicks. Uh, they're, they're a good team, they're tough to score against and uh, uh, possess the ball very well and um, like I said, I, I think we played maybe as close as, as good as we could it just wasn't enough on uh, on Friday night so uh, so obviously the season ended uh, and uh, I just want to kind of take this time now just to say thank you to uh, our seniors uh, they've uh, we have a group of six seniors that have worked extremely hard over the four years and um, have really made an impact on the program glad that they got to experience the uh, the championship uh, but they've also had some success in other areas. They've, uh, you know, we've we've hosted two games in the tournament um, uh, while they've been here, and that, that's never happened happened before. And then obviously we've set records this year for our uh, goals against and shutouts and things like that. So, so they've had a, a very uh, successful career, and, and know they'll go on and do some great things um, after they graduate from you and I. You know, you look at our, our defensive record this year was very good, and uh, I think everybody. Uh, bar one, Maddie Welch is a senior on that back line, but Whitney Blunt's back in, from in the goalkeeper position, uh, and then we had a couple of injuries in the back line that um, those girls have come back. So yeah, I think you know whenever you're talking about having a good base and a good um, good defensive shape that I think this program has, and um, then that's a good base for them to kind of really uh, get back. And and we talked after the game is like you know we. We, we want this to be a regular thing where we're back in the semi-finals and finals of, of the conference, not just one one time every four years. It has to become a regular thing for the program, and that's that's going to be the goal for, for the girls going forward, there's no doubt. Obviously, this is this will be my last uh, uh, press luncheon, so I want to thank all of you for your support of UNI Athletics and, and the soccer program. And, uh, you know, so I'm, not, I'm not going very far, but um, so I'm sure I'll see some of you around. But, uh, again, I just want to thank everybody for all their continued support of UNI Athletics.